salt and pepper's hair. No. Oh, oh. Nothing like driving off road with your check engine light on. What's up, everybody? I'm Nikki, the sleepy boy over here. This is Camper, and we live in this 2006 Toyota Prius. And right now I'm eating salad out of a chip bag. Yep. We're in Arkansas. It's amazing. This is part three of a three, might be more part series. And it's just a blast. Gosh, thanks for being here, y'all. Let's just do it. Yep. <laughs> oh God. That's good. Previously in Arkansas. And don't you miss part one and two. Link will be in the description. Camper, say goodbye. We departed our staycation at Self Creek and headed north. A couple hours into our drive in true camper in Nikki fashion, I spotted a dog roaming around at a gas station and I stopped to see if it was okay. Are you somebody's doggy? Are you somebody's puppy? Hi. I went inside to buy snacks and asked them if they'd seen the dog before and they said it's definitely a stray, which is weird. As it had been there before, they said, but I don't know, it just seems so weird to me being in such good shape, so. I don't know, I'm gonna hang out for a little bit. Maybe see if, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Oh, I mean, can I fit two dogs in a Prius? I have to. It's so pretty and she's so sweet. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm gonna call the vet in the shelter nearby. Good news. After some searching and calls, I found the owner. Oh, baby. Bonnie. Oh, Bonnie! I was so worried about you, Bonnie. Okay, Bonnie has a home. Thank you. <laughs> the Prius won't have two dogs today, but who knows in the future? Oh. God, you fired. Here we are, living the life, the camper life. Dinner. I want snacks. Excuse me while I get to my core. Let me show you how it's done, eh? Oh yeah, that's sexy time. Okay, let's see if I can bring you guys along on the adventure. That's not the most flattering angle in the world, but here we are. Unflattering angles is my middle name. Here we go. I'm gonna show you all the goods. Excuse me. Excuse me. Fine, we're gonna go in. Oh God, you're so heavy. Yes. I'm gonna have some green juice. Oh, you want some? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Check engine light is on again. <laughs> Here we are, living the life. We're going to go to AutoZone in the morning. I'm gonna check out. Crap! Shoot! It's a baby wipe kind of evening. It's a baby wipe kind of night. <laughs> yes, we did it. <laughs> I also have these like alarms, right? Sure, it can't do anything physically if someone attacks you, but it will startle them with the loudest alarm you've ever heard in your life and someone else will hear it. So if there's ever an emergency, that thing is being pulled immediately. And I have one up here. I have one hanging on the carabiner right here. And I have one with me when I'm hiking. Another good idea is like a personal beacon, a locator, things like that, you know? Okay guys, I'm going to wet washcloth and change. All right, so I will hang this. It's a very wet towel. I will wring it out outside if I need to. 
and I'll just hang it on the oh poop handle so that can dry. And then I will take my dirty laundry, put that in here, and wow, we are ready for bed. Night, guys. What do we do, Kevin? Oh, yeah. In the middle of the night, we switched. We put our feet where our head was. Our head where our feet were. Mm. Baby. All right, so we got our clothes out of our bag here. You want to come up here and have breakfast? <gasps> I just spilled water all over myself. Oh. Take the wheel, dude. Wow, why are you letting him pass us? Come on, put the pedal to the metal, lady. All right, there we go. Okay, got a couple options here. One, it's still the gas cap, so option two, there's a leak in one of the hoses, and those tests are not fun, so. It's a buy yourself some coffee kind of morning, and right next door is a coffee shop, so. Yeah! Morning! Morning! Oh my god, it's so cute in here. Oh, hi! I love coffee. <laughs> He's just greeting everybody that walks in. What's his name? Camper. Hey, Camper. Hi, Camper. Um, so I called my favorite hybrid specialist in Denver, Mile Hybrid, and it's okay to drive with this, just a very small leak, but you guys, Pine Bay Coffee, they gifted me some coffee. I'm like so excited. This place is amazing. You guys, Arkansas is like the true definition of Southern hospitality. I'm obsessed with this place and this coffee. <laughs> Got milk? like small very small leak so nothing to worry about too too much so we're gonna go hiking no big deal by the way if nobody knew this if you are in an area that doesn't have service on Google Maps you can go to offline maps and download an entire area so that way even if you don't have service you can still get anywhere within that area and the GPS will work if you don't have service if you've been in my situation, that's not fun. So I always download offline maps if I can prior to going to an area that I don't know if has service or not. All right, so we are officially in the Ozarks. Oh yeah, camper. Nothing like driving off road with your check engine light on. Woo! What a ride. Oh yeah. We hit the trail and trekked our way through the Arkansas wilderness. Got startled by some dangerous, dangerous beings. That's just grass and plants. And made it to a clearing and today's hiking destination. Lion King, you got it right. After some time at the top, we made our way back down to shower in the wild and find camp, but not without stopping for a swim first, since that's Camper's new hobby. And we did it. Home sweet home. Yep, we're gonna take a shower out here. We have our body pods. Biodegradable. We're not near a fresh water source, that's good. And I need a sponge. I would recommend poking holes in the top of this, but I'm just lazy. Love you, Camp. I have a video solely on showering and I personally think it's hilarious. So I'm gonna put the link in the description so you guys could see all my different shower methods. This is one of them, less than a gallon of water. It's unbelievable, saves water. You can shower wherever you want. It's pretty incredible. You really don't need, oh God, I'm about to get kicked up by dust. No, slow down. I hate when that happens. You really don't need massive towels, you guys. Like, one towel, that's it. That feels so good. 
I'm so clean. All of my wet clothes and things will start to go on all of the handles. Oh, poop. Oh, poop handles. So each one will get its own so it can dry overnight. And then I'll flip it, got them from the back. And there are some creeps that are literally, have been watching me shower and it's making me very uncomfortable. People are weird. Stop staring. So, we put up the blockers. <sighs> Pajamas. This needs to be run out. So, when I'm not in a town or somewhere where I can get a legit shower or even a campground like here, there's nothing for like an hour. So, that's how I'll shower off, off grid. And honestly, I feel just as clean as I would with any other shower. The only difference is I don't wash my hair out here because obviously that takes a lot of water and I wanna make sure I have two gallons tomorrow as I only had three gallons today, so. Okay, so I have some trash from the day. So I always take a plastic bag and that's where the trash goes and this will go at my feet while we're sitting here, not while we're driving. And then, so I have my dirty clothes for the day. Obviously from, they're sweaty, so I'm going to just lay them out on the dash because all my things are taken up, but you do not want to put your dirty laundry away wet. That's when you get smelly car. I've never had a smelly car to this day because I am super, super consistent on making sure everything is dry before I put it away. If it was smelly, I got a roof box, so we good. It's 410. <laughs> Wow, it's early. I already took a shower and put on pajamas at four o'clock in the afternoon. Yikes. I'm gonna make a salad in the bag of chips I ate in one day. Yeah, I'm pretty proud of that. I don't have carrots, you guys. I'm like really upset about this. So there will be no carrot chopping tonight. Sorry, I know. It's such a sexy, sexy moment. You're welcome. I've never seen anything like that. I know it's not organic, it's very off-brand, it's very not me, but sometimes you just gotta live, you know? Oh my God, why did I do that? <laughs> Blueberries, hummus, salt and peppers, hey, I'm working on the Not you too. I'm the queen of like eating dinner before I even eat dinner. Actually, it's happening. Great Northern American, I don't remember what they're called, beans and already cut up avocado. This is probably my favorite thing because I'm not going to lose them. I just want to know what the funniest part about camper snoring is. My whole life said if a guy was a snorer, it would be a deal breaker. This was in my 20s, okay? Of course I get the dog that is just like a monster. But he's so cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just can't. I can't right now. Um, look at that. I've had a 12 minute conversation with myself. Does that make me crazy? I can tell you the people watching me think I'm crazy. Crazy's fun. Everyone's a little crazy. You gotta be a little crazy to do what we do, you know? I'm not talking crazy, get in trouble with the law crazy. I'm talking live in your car crazy. I'm talking quit your job if you hate it crazy. Follow your dreams crazy with a plan, right? Always save, invest, have a plan. Set yourself up for the future. But you don't have to be miserable to do that. Just saying, crazy can be good shower in public crazy just did it clothes okay so at like you know five miles an hour we are just gonna drive a little further down the road for a camp spot oh, oh there's electric what and water can't breathe i'm going to bed now five o'clock don't hide the meat stick in my clothes no He's hiding the meat stick in my clothes. My clothing. He's always trying to hide his stuff. I made you that bed. I don't want holes in it. Good job. 
Good job. Yep, no one's gonna find that. All right, you keep hiding the stick. I'm gonna get us ready for bed, okay? I know you. Are you gonna sleep with mama tonight? Should I move that so you have room? Are you gonna do that again tonight? I bet you 20 bucks you're gonna. We're gonna move it. Oh my god. Is there anything cuter in this world? Thanks for watching. Don't forget, like, subscribe, share with your friends, turn on notifications, and Camper and I will see you next time. And for $1 a month, join our Patreon. The link is in the description. If you want to see our videos, ad free for the first 24 to 48 hours that they're posted in efforts to help support our charity, Camper Cares.